Hey kids, it's me, Dad. This is the Gaming with Dad show. Of course, you do happen to know that today we are taking a look at, yes, Storm Tale 2 for the Nintendo Switch to try and decide is this worth it. Now, normally $19.99, but it's on sale for $1.99 until July 27th, 2023. So, if you are looking, yeah, okay, great. I, oh God, it's one of those. There we go. Yeah, we'll go challenged. Yeah, casual, that's fine. Uh, sharpen your sword and take up your bow. It's time to fight back a powerful sorcerer and his mighty dragon. So, uh, this game was released January 21st, 2022. It is the second of the Hello. Storm Fronts. I'm so okay, yep. Plot, look, there's a vacant city that you end up having to try to rebuild. A uh, single system puzzle adventure strategy from Green Sauce Games. Everybody loves a little Salsa Verde. Rated E for everyone. T uh, supports all the play modes. It is 294, uh, 294 megabytes. Not 95 megabytes. 94. And it is available in Dutch, English, French, German, Japanese, and Portuguese. So, the very first thing that you have to do is you have to find these scrolls. And there are 12 of them. Yes, that's right. Twelve scrolls. Now, while you think this may just be another of those annoying point and clicks, there is more to this game. There's a scroll. There's a scroll. There's a scroll. It's like secret invasion in this place. So many scrolls. <laughs> Marvel fans, maybe you got that. Oh, that really looks like one. But I guess it's not. Oh, look, they're behind the table leg. Okay, let's go over here. And... In the piss pot... Oh, there. I guess I have two more. I need the five. Or just one more. Eh, no. Okay. So, first things first. Graphically. Not really sure. Um. It's annoying. This first bit is annoying. Because, honestly speaking, the graphics look okay. They're not great here. But this isn't the game. That's what kills me. It's not really the game. There it is. There we go. We got it. Yes, okay, thanks. Let's do that. Thank you, my friend. But, I mean, the graphics are functional and stylistic. These cutscenes, very reminiscent of old action RPGs and those point-and-click games that we've done on this show before. But, again, this isn't just a point-and-click. That said, though, I have played quite a bit of this. Uh, I'm going to give the graphics a 16. Likewise, I'm going to give the music 
a 15 though for 31 it's it's just really base uh, there, there's not a lot going on here um, audio wise let's move that up to skip there we go uh, controls one of my least favorite mechanisms is this stupid cursor thing because yep that's gonna be it's a PC game Oh, that, that blow. It really does have a Fortnite Season 2 or 3 look to it. There we go. Welcome back, my friend. I can see it takes more than a dragon to scare off the... Okay. I just... Yes, I know. We need to rebuild the village. Okay. So you come in here, you go to levels, you move up there when you're actually in what is the game here it is it is a simple matching game oh. yes skip the tutorial so in this case I have to come up with 32 woods that's a lot of wood That is really a lot of wood. Okay. You just move things around, match them up, and uh, do your best. You have 34 moves here, 32 there. In all honesty, though, uh, I take it back what I said about in-game controls because... This is awkward with the mouse cursor. It works better with the touch screen, admittedly. So if you're playing mobile, you're good. If you're having to try to capture, oh, you're not doing as good. Uh, there we go. Let's just uh, scooch this stuff around here. I mean, do a foursome there. Uh, that did not sound correct. Okay, there we go. I really... Wee bit annoying, that's all. So, yeah, this in total... This is the game. At least as far as I've been able to get. It, it's... Um... But, that said, it is competently done. Um... But I've got to rate controls. I'm going to give the controls a 14. This mouse cursor thing annoys me. The touch screen. Thank God they did touch screen. So, yeah, 14, that brings us to 45. Gameplay. Oh, it wants it there. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little dull and repetitive. Come on, give, let me... So, um, even though it is competently made, it's difficult to subscribe this as being fun. Um, and that's what a game is supposed to be, isn't it? I mean, I've always thought games were supposed to be fun. Um, and quite literally, I'm I I'm actually gonna lose this level because ah. Uh, Frick 
like a duck. Okay, so I have ten moves to complete this. So, um, yeah, um, and it also combines this tile matching genre with the the virtual city building which to me is just a weird combination and I'm not sure it's a combination that works for me actually I can tell you it's a combination that doesn't really work for me four moves left Okay, so, how do I... Let's hit that bomb. There we go, we got it complete. Miraculous! Two moves left! Okay, so, I've collected the wood. And now I can sit here and load back in. This... Screams mobile. That's my problem. Yes. Okay, go over here. Tap that. We built that. And look, it's a sawmill. There's a guy sawing. The uh, table saw apparatus from uh, Freaky. <sighs> It's just, it's there. Um, so, yeah, gameplay. I'm going to give this a 13 on gameplay. I know if I gave it a 14, I'd be able to say noise. But, or, no, we're actually only up to 58. So, now, let's talk value and value on this bad boy at 19.99 is a 7 for 65 ah uh, that that's not that I don't want to see my debts get paid or anything along those lines but my god 20 bones is a lot of money for this and it's not worth it Oh, uh, look, I can look at my trophies. I'm going to claim those. Get the fictional gem potatoes as in-game currency, which allows me then to buy other things. See, this really does just scream mobile pay-to-win. It says I've got one more trophy that I'm missing. Oh, there it is. And it does work well on the screen play, but yeah, it's a 65. Um, which I guess is a passing grade. Um, but it's not a good grade. But, you know, a D gets the degree, so who am I to complain? <sighs> now, in the grand scheme of things, at a buck ninety-nine though, which is what it's costing right now, that is a good deal. But still not a stellar one. And so I I am. I'm gonna have to say... Sixteen. For a grand total of... We were at fifty-eight. I said sixteen. 
Oh, God. 74? Yeah. No. Yeah, 74. So, a 74. It is a valiant effort by the devs to jumble some very unusual game modes together but it just doesn't hit so if you enjoy this type of game I guess yeah you can pick it up but it's I have a hard time recommending it With that said, we'll talk to you guys next time. Bye bye So, here's a video and a subscribe link. Make sure to subscribe, ring the bell, like, comment, all that goodness. Thank you.